Okay, so I, I mentioned briefly that uh, I could go to disc, uh, go to Shoreline and get a lot of loot, so I'm going to do that and I'm also going to go for the final bit of a specific task there where I have to find a chemical container. Um, I know where it is and I have the key for it already, so that's going to be our main objective, but since it's in a high loot area, I'm thinking I'm probably going to hit up uh, as many rooms as I can. So I'm just trying to think if there's any other keys I need for Shoreline. Uh, I think those are all the high value ones that I have. I could get a 220 key, West Wing 220. How much is that? Um, mm, it's kind of a lot of money, but it does have a good spawn. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll probably make that money back pretty quickly, just running on it. So yeah. Let's just go do shoreline. And we're gonna do it at daytime, because I don't have night vision, and shoreline's scary at night. Ah, oh, this is a shit spawn. Absolutely garbage. The only decent area around this place is this house right here. And it's not nearly as good as it used to be in earlier uh, patches. Used to have like a high chance to spawn some good loot, now it doesn't. Or it doesn't spawn the good loot nearly as often. I also really should have brought um, something long range, since this vector is rather crap. Uh, outside of like 50 yards. And even that's a bit of a stretch. I didn't know you could find contacts in a toolbox. Good to know. There are people fighting off to the right. Sounds like some kind of big gun and then some SMG. Alright. People are fighting over by the mansion area. That's the same mansion area. This is called Suicide Fields because you're visible from pretty much everywhere on the map. That's not true. But uh, the Suicide Fields is because you are visible from a high number of places get shot in the back, the front, the side, from the houses over there. That's where the fighting was. I wonder if Scav Boss is here. If Scav Boss is over by the mansion so he can fucking stay over there. I hate that motherfucker. He has enough stimulants, meds, to make himself basically into a tank. There's a fairly valuable key spawn over uh, up that way, but I'm not going to even try and go for it since I actually made pretty good time to the, uh, to the resort building, which is where really good loot spawns. So I'm going to see if I can't be one of the first people in and grabbing stuff before anything else happens. Um, so there was fighting back that way from spawn. I found this key on the last interchange run. Has the potential to spawn a key card inside, which is very valuable. That's someone above me. He took my stomach out. Motherfucker. I have to repair that. I hope he doesn't have a teammate. 
Right now you can see my hydration and energy are dropping because my stomach's blacked out. That should uh, be fixed once I once I unblack it out. God damn, that was a one shot to the stomach. He must have had a shotgun or something. Because he didn't even hit my armor at all. Oh, I really should have brought more meds with me. Whatever, I have my backup in my gamma, so if I need to use that, I can. Uh, oh, he had a vector as well. Oh, he has a 45 vector. Ooh, that's good armor. It's armor you can't buy. CMS kit? I need that. Adrenaline is valuable. Alloys brilliant. Better than nothing. Uh, let's do this. to just stand there. Has a laser on it. That helps with hip fire a little bit. It like makes your hip fire more accurate. Ibuprofen, that's nice. I need one more CMS kit for my quest. It's a helmet. Oh, it's a razor. Alright, that's fine. Compacts, don't need them. Can't we even wear them with this helmet? So that's whatever. What's an aggressor? Hang I've never seen that before. If I haven't seen it, it means it's not valuable. Uh, what else? Here we go. This is 219. I don't remember what's in here. I think it's just an ammo spawn, really. Okay, never mind. Nothing. Uh, didn't I have... yeah, I had some hot rod. This'll keep my energy up a little bit, and also my hydration. You can get tech spawn right there, which is nice. Uh, cord. I think I need a cord for something. Of course, I'm running out of room now. Water. Mayo. Augmentum. Let's see. Uh, the mayo is valuable. That's 15k. Mayo might be the same, but whatever. And then screws we can get rid of and keep the water in case I need it. <laughs> Me think someone is close by. Like, they're around this corner. Yeah, see? Don't need an increased hip fire when you have a fucking vector. This guy had kill armor as well. Holy crap. 
Maybe I should drop my vest and just take theirs. Um, that's 45, that's 28. Alright, so I would take his. Ah, uh, shit. Alright, watch carefully, kids. You're gonna witness... Ah, this guy doesn't even have a good vest. He has a fucking scav vest. Damn it. I can't carry shit in that. I'm gonna, uh, gonna have to go take uh, the first guy's vest. This is called insurance fraud. So first, we drop that. Then, take this. Nope, we don't want it quick. Alright. That's not what I wanted to do quite yet. Take those. Let's go in... I want to find like some room nobody's going to ch bother checking. Good enough. Alright, let's go take this. Really hope we don't get shot because we don't have armor right now. And then take that. Alright. He's got a couple of meds on him. That's cool. I guess. Those are valuable sometimes. Uh, he's got a shrimp. Contacts aren't valuable, but Zagustin and Morphine are. And then I can take this gun. I thought I heard, like, jumping just now. It may have been bullets, though. It may have been someone shooting. Oh, he's got slugs. I learned recently slugs are not nearly as valuable as I thought they were, so I'm just going to leave that. Uh, oh, i got to rebind my meds. That's four, five, six, seven... And that should be... no, he, my hemostat should be 8. It's faster to use. Okay. I'm overweight. <laughs> yeah, people are fighting over where I said that, uh, that key spawned. 306. Here we go. Unlock. So, like, I could fit a lot more valuable items if I... Uh, dropped this killer armor, but it would mean like you can't get that armor from anyone other than by killing the scab boss on interchange. So it's it's pretty valuable as is, and it repairs very well. So uh, it, when you lose durability on it, you don't lose nearly as much as you would with some other armors. Even my tac tech doesn't repair as well as that, so it's definitely worth uh, throwing down the tac tech and hopefully getting it back in insurance. Even if I don't get it back in insurance, it's still worth the trade. Where am I going? Ah! Doing that. Took damage because I'm overweight and I fell. If I hadn't fallen, I wouldn't have, uh, wouldn't have taken, or if I ha wasn't overweight, I wouldn't have taken damage. I fucking hate that glass hallway. So there's two, uh, key spawns in this building that are very good keys. 218, uh, which I have as well as to 16, I think, which I have already. But if I find them and can get out with them, one spawns right here. Uh, if they're here and I can get out with them, that's uh, probably 100k each. Ah, shit. I spent too much time at low, um, low stamina, so now I take an additional penalty to my energy drain. You can see it's 3.13 uh, now instead of the regular 2 point something. And that's because I spent too much time at low energy, uh, low stamina.
Apple juice does hydration and energy, I think, right? Yeah. I have no idea what an SAS does. I don't know if it's valuable. I don't know anything about it. But it's probably more valuable than an ally splint because ally splints are fucking cheap as hell. I need a plug for a quest. Um, let's just use this now. Max hydration, nearly max energy. That's nice. I forget what the green battery is used for, but it's a purple background that generally means it's valuable. I should really drop the cord and the horse. They are not nearly as valuable as some of the other things that you can get. G phone, that's used for some crafting. I also need it for a quest, but I already did the quest. Yep, there's the last plug. I just need to get out with those two, and that's half a quest done. Dorm room 218. You need that for a quest, I think. An optional objective on a quest. I already did the quest, and it's not a good key, so I'm just going to drop it. Whoops. Oh, there's three key spawns in this building, actually. One spawns here, I think room 104, east wing, and that's valuable as well. Not as valuable as the other two, though. PM pistol, not valuable at all. These, uh, there's five computers in this area, or maybe six, and they can all spawn a flash drive, which you need five of them for t two for one quest and three for another. They all need to be found in raid. So it's worth checking, uh, but I already did both those quests, so I don't really need to check. I still, I still look for flash drives just because uh, there's a, a craft, that, a crafting recipe that you need them for. That's pretty valuable. Uh, Keck tape, that's useful. And if you're wondering if uh, they knew what they were doing and they called it Keck tape, they absolutely did. It was introduced as a, uh, it was introduced after they got super popular on Twitch. So just a good thing it's not like a pog tape or something. You can get some good tech spawns over here, like graphics cards or in this case a motor. Uh, CPU, I need that. And a graphics card, that's super valuable. Uh, I need to drop something for that. Graphics cards are, I think, 600,000 right now. So th even if I don't live through this raid, uh, it's, it's worth... Ah! Ow. I really need to stop doing those fucking drops. Now, I'm willing to bet this area's already been looted. Because it's kind of... You rarely get to loot in the entire resort building. It's usually you loot half and uh, someone else loots the other half, and I bet you that's what already happened. Do I have any good keys? Oh, I don't have any good keys on the second floor at least. I do on the first. I have this key. No, that's 112. Uh, 110, I have this key. Oh, it's already been looted, damn it. You can get some really good spawns in this room. Lead X's and stuff that are like a million per. That's a fucking letdown. All right, uh, let's see, what was my Objective. Ah, shit, I have to go to the other fucking side of the building. I forgot to get my objective from the West Wing. Damn it. Alright, this is gonna be a fucking risky, risky run. Alright, there's fighting in the other wing already. I think that's an ADAR firing. With the echoes and stuff, I can't really be sure, though. 
super sus running across this bridge, but nobody shot at me. Hallelujah. Was that a scav? No, that was a PMC. He had an SKS. I don't know if that was what was firing. Um, so he killed that scav and that scav. Yeah, that, I think that was what was firing. But I'm not sure about that. There's my quest item. Alright, time to go. Level 26. Nice. Eh. Fuck, I am a fat boy. This is going to take me a while to get to extract. Unless something exciting happens or I have something to say, I'm probably just going to cut to exfil. I just see someone. I swear I saw legs. Yeah, okay. There's someone over there. I think they're going to Xville. And if they're going to Xville, I'm fucking happy to let them have it. They're fighting someone. Ah, shit. Ah, shitty shit shit. Jesus Christ, man. Careful with that. I'm gonna kill someone. of these things. No, oh, no I don't. I thought I had more than that. Did I get him? Nah, that's a scab. Shit. Fuck it. I don't care. Get me out of here. Beef stew and my gunpowder completed. So we got three kills. Yeah, so we didn't kill the guy at the end there. I don't know if he was hiding or if he extracted. But we got three kills. And a high level player too. That's nice. 497 flesh, 283 armor, 76 ammo used, 22 hits. And we leveled up. No, we didn't. Oh. We'll level up when I turn in the quest. Oh right, I had my stomach blacked out right at the start. Other than the stomach thing, the only damage we took was from fall damage. Alright, so. Graphics card. We are keeping this. It is very valuable. And it's also my first one that I don't have to turn in for a quest. So that's awesome. Now, this plug and... This CMS kit and this plug are all quest items as well for therapist. Uh, 
car repair, turn in both of these. So now I just need one more car battery. And, oh, the CMS kit, is that for you? No? Is it for you? Yes. So I need one more CMS kit found in raid. And then the G phone we're keeping. Whoopsies. Ah, should I put that somewhere? G phone. Keeping it with my other G phones. CPU. I guess I don't need a CPU. I thought I needed a CPU for something. We're gonna keep that. Uh, ibuprofen goes in the mid case. Tech tape we definitely need. That is a craft item. Now, kill armor. Alright, well, first of all, Zagustin, Adrenaline, we sell that. Mayo, I don't know if I already have a mayo, so I'm going to keep it. Uh, morphine, definitely keeping that in med case, along with the aloe splint and that. Coffee is a crafting item. S SAS, crafting item, I think. Green battery, crafting item. Now, these two armors are super valuable, so we're going to repair this guy. 27,000 only loses that much amount of... And durability, awesome. Thousand for repair. Uh, you're slightly better quality, so we're gonna use you. Now let's look in our items case. What do I have in here? Can I make easy room? I'd have to take out a three by three gazelle. Do I want to do that? No, I don't. Is the answer. And then I have another Vector with uh, a couple of big boy mags. I wonder if he was using it good ammo. The black my stomach that quickly? He may not have been. He may have been... Nope, he was using good ammo. Alright. I'll shut my mouth. We did go through quite a bit of ammo, but that's whatever. Oh, and we came out with a tri-zip backpack. That's nice. Um, fuck, I need to make room for that somehow. I'm probably just going to sell that guy's vector after I take his ammo. Nope. Uh, um, unload. Unload. Unload in the chamber. So that gun alone was 100k. Uh, oof, I do not have a lot of room in that ammo case, as in none. I can trade for an ammo case, I think. Uh, I need gunpowder to trade for an ammo case, I'm not going to do that yet. So all that's set, uh, give me some more AP, uh, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, that, oh, that can be sold. I have a quest to actually hand those stimulants in. I probably shouldn't have sold them. Whatever. Alright, so we have completed production of something. Blue gunpowder. That's nice. I need to make another blue gunpowder. Uh... I need 70 of this round. There's proper here. It's not the cheapest, but I know I can get 70 easily from him, so I will pay a little bit extra for it. Nope. That's not the one I wanted. Nope, that's also not the one I wanted. There we go. And then... finished making some of these. So I'm gonna make two more of them. Fucking expensive as hell to produce, but it's so much easier to make them than actually find them in raid. Because there's a quest where you need to find 15 in raid, and that's just fucking boring as hell. I'm not gonna go hunting around the map for a can of fucking small... uh, what is it? Can of steak or something? Beef stew. Fuck that. So I'll need to make the two I'm making right now and then two more after that. That's whatever. And then Prapper just went out to find the attack deck I dropped. So yeah, that was a good raid. Definitely, uh, I'm not sure I made money on that, 
but I got two items that are super valuable, those killer armors. So yeah, I'll, you know, that's, I'm happy with that. And I got a couple of good quest items. The fucking uh, GPU, 600K. That's so valuable. I'm really happy I got that. But that's what I mean about not necessarily, uh, like everything has its own value. So you can come out with a million dollars worth of items and just sell them immediately and get a million dollars or a million rubles, or you can hold on to them and use them. Which is better, I don't know. Personally, I say you should use what you find, and then, or sorry, you should sell, uh, because at the beginning of a wipe, items are always gonna cost more. So near the end of the wipe, they cost less. So realistically, I should probably just sell this graphics card. I'd probably make more profit by selling it. And actually, I only have 600K ripples right now and it's oh my god it's going for seven all right yeah we're selling it um shit i need it to be out of the scab case to sell seven hundred k boom cost seventy six thousand a place but if you're making seven hundred k on it you know that's fucking worth and then worst comes to worst, I can sell some of my fucking uh, more valuable stuff like the lion or the rooster or the teapots, GPXs and stuff. But I don't need to right now. Boom, just like that, 1.3 mil total cash. Nice. Alright. Yeah, that was a really good run. I'm happy with that.